So once I have put all of my in-text citations into my document instead of the big long citations, I also can go through and get my work cited set before I even start working on my project. That way it's done and I don't have to worry about it. So I'm going to go back to EasyBib and I'm going to um, go to my bibliography and I'm going to um, just export and you have different options. You could go to a Google Doc, but I like to have all of my stuff in one document, so I'm just going to copy and paste it, because um, if you go to Google Doc, it's going to put it in a new Google Doc. I would rather copy and paste into a Google Doc, but hold on. As I look here, I realize that there are some things I did not use in my notes. I didn't actually use this source. So I'm going to go back, and um, you can either delete it out of your project um, completely, but I would always prefer to leave it in there just in case I decide to go back and look for some more information. So I'm just going to go ahead and copy it and um, I'm doing control A and then control V or um, copy and I'm going to paste it at the very bottom of my um, project. But then I'm going to go through and I'm going to delete all the sources I didn't do. Like I know I didn't use this phosphorus cycle one I did that one, um, I did that one, I did that one, I, used, I didn't use that one, and I didn't use that one. So your works cited should only include the sources that you um, actually used in your, in your presentation. Now you also need to make sure you get rid of these, these um, big long URLs. Um, many teachers would love for you to link it um, to link your title and your articles to any sources that really helps them to be able to go and see the information um, and possibly use those sources themselves and that's um, a great service to your teachers and some teachers require it so what you're gonna do is you're gonna copy the URL without the carrots without these little guys right here so you're gonna delete that and delete that and you're just gonna copy that um, or actually cut it, you can, because um, you don't need it in there. And then you're going to highlight the title, or select the title, and you can either use this button or Control K. And then you're going to paste it, Control V, or you can right click, print, and there you go. You've got a linked um, document. So this is what my finished work cited looks like. See, I've got each source linked, and it's in alphabetical order. EasyBib should do that for you, but um, you always want to just take a look. And I'm just going to scan through to make sure that there aren't too many NP and D things. So um, there's no um, publisher um, here, but we've got the title here. That's fine. Um, and I think it looks great.